unboxings that we've had on this channel has been <laughs> like package updates from when we were getting our spaceship earth remember that and like it took three tries to get one that wasn't broken okay i'm hoping that that is not going to be the case for today it kept popping up on my like feed like on social media of like different advertisement and i'm like this looks amazing i'm not gonna lie it was a little a little spendy for a Christmas decoration, but I think it's gonna be completely worth it. I looked up some reviews online, but I'm like, I didn't even wanna like, like look through the like tons and tons of pictures that it has for this because I kinda wanted it to be a surprise because it looks so amazing, like so amazing. I send it to my husband and he's like, just get it for Christmas. You can have it now and you can open it early if you want. And I'm like, okay, okay. So I was gonna be having a cruise vlog video for you guys this week, but I'm just like, you know what? Like this has to happen like right now. It just literally just came in the mail. I wasn't even like set up. So it's a mess in here. Um, you guys can't see all of it, but trust me, it's messy. I started opening it. There was like this envelope, like taped to the top of the box. And I'm like, what is this? And then I saw the company that it came from. And I think it's like the, you have to certify it for authenticity and everything is from the Bradford exchange. Okay. I called my mom. She's just like, yes, good company. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm excited because this looks amazing. It is a big box. You guys like legit big box. I'm really excited. Everything that I've seen on this, I just, like I said, looked at reviews and they said that like the quality is so good. So grab a drink and we have some goodies to open up and I need my Disney peeps to understand the level of excitedness that I have because it looks so good. Do you guys have like a little cutter that you use? I always have my knives because they're like short, like, pointy I don't know I always like tend to grab them but it looks so good yeah see I just started to open it and I'm like oh I didn't even like think I honestly thought it would be like here after Christmas but it wasn't let me scoot back and you guys can kind of see a little bit more you guys I'm all feeling all the cozies are you guys feeling all the cozies it's so warm here this is really might be difficult to get out of the box but I kind of want to save the box because I'm thinking I'm going to probably store it in the box. All right, pre-workout, you're going to have to move. The letters are this way. You can see it's kind of got like a little something. It's a little difficult to try and do this on my own. And of course, I'm by myself. Ooh, it's heavy. See, this is what I love. Like, this is some shipping packaging, like, done right. Like, because see how it's all, like, sealed, like, really, really sealed, and then it's taped all the way around the seal. So let me lay this back down. And I hate styrofoam. Like, I hate it. I know, like, it does, like, such a good job, but it's so messy. Like, ugh. Like, heaven forbid you cut. See, I just cut a little bit. Ugh. And there goes the bubbles. You get like these little packing bead things like all over the place. Oh, that just feels horrible on my teeth. Oh, that's a horrible sound, you guys. I'm sorry. Are we there yet? Can we open it yet? No, we still got more. Legit pack. Oh, legit packaging done right. Okay, okay. Are we there? Are we there? Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't know what this is. I First, it's got like this little, this little gold hook, okay. See below for accessories, okay. I don't even know how to get this out of here. Okay, hold on. Oh my god. Okay, the only thing is, is like he doesn't really look like Mickey. <laughs> like he kind of looks like scary Mickey, how he used to be. And the deer have really big eyes. Pluto doesn't look too bad. Okay, let me scoot for it and I can show you guys this. The Wonderful World of Disney Christmas Tree. Oh wow. Sculpture 
RC1475. Disney Bradford Exchange. Okay, it, yeah, it looks like legit. But like the characters' faces look a little scary. Like, look at, do we see Mickey? I think he looks a little scary, you guys. He looks like old school, like Walt's Disney. Or Walt's Mickey. And then look at like the, the deer. They're like deer in headlights. <laughs> Okay, so it has a ton of characters, but their faces don't look good. Mm. Okay, it looks really amazing. Let's take it out. It, wow. Okay, so there's tons of Mickeys, but look at, okay, first of all, look at huge. It is like legit quality. Uh. But their faces look horrible, you guys. I'm not going to lie. Like, oh, do these move? Does this legit move? Okay, there's instructions. You know what? I bet. Hold on. Let's put this together a little bit. Oh, and it plugs in. Okay. I thought maybe it would have batteries, but I'd rather it plug in because I could put this on a remote. <laughs> You guys know, like, I have been, if you follow me on Instagram, I, like, every day I'm, like, click, click, click. I love that thing. Okay. So, I got it all, I think, put together. So, what's cool, I did know this, is that this is going to kind of spin around, okay? And it's, like, the castle, and then there are the trains and the dancers. There is a ton of characters on here. Like, I love Chip and Dale. I think you guys know this. Chip and Dale are right here. They don't look that great. And like there's hidden Mickeys. Like look at this little like hidden Mickey on the train here. Sorry. Can you see that tiny little hidden Mickey? Okay, it's really cool, but like the faces don't look, I don't know, like a lot, like that's not even like a face. Like, I don't know. I'll, I'll get some footage here of it, like up close and personal. I don't know. It was, it was a lot. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Let's plug it in. I swear. It's really cute though. It's kind of cute. It's kind of really cute, but why do their faces have to look horrible? I don't know if I can get past their faces because the faces look legit messed up. Oh, okay, so then you can turn it off and then have it with no sound, but just like the lights and it moving. And see like every level there's like the train is coming around here. I really like it you guys, but their faces look horrible. I don't know, maybe I should have done my research a little bit more. What would you guys do? Put it down in the comments down below. Put it down in the comments down below. I didn't even tell Instagram that I was doing this, so I'm gonna put this all on you guys. Put it down in the comments below. Would you keep it? And I'll link it down below so like you can kind of see for yourself and you can see like how expensive it was. It was over 200. And then plus tax and shipping was $25. Mm. The cool thing is you have a one year return, which is really nice. I don't know. I love all the characters. I really like, here, let's talk about some positives here. Okay, so I really like the characters on here a lot. I really like that like it would be like a scavenger hunt for my kids because my kids would legit be obsessed with this. Like I think it would be so cool. It's a very cool conversation piece. The glitter is beautiful. The colors are beautiful. Like, I would say the colors in that are spot on. So that's just what kills me is like all their faces are jacked up. I don't know. Like, I'm just saying like if Costco can make things cheaper and their faces look better, I don't think then this then should be more expensive. Like, like I will say the quality is much better. The thought is much better. It's really heavy. <laughs> um, Like, I will say that, but... And the details are just amazing. Like, but like, how did we skimp on the faces? Like the faces are bad. 
let me grab my phone here. Hold on. Let me grab my phone and let's look online together of like what it looks like in the pictures. Because maybe this is just my bad. Okay, so it's called the Ultimate Disney 75 Character Tabletop Christmas Tree. No, the faces do not look like the pictures at all. No, no, no. That is not what I got. At all. See, this is where I get annoyed. Like, I'm not going to lie. Like, this is annoying. I paid a decent amount for this. It was $200 plus tax and shipping. Um, it does not look like the pictures at all. At all. So, I'm going to call them and see if I got a... Maybe we shouldn't do these videos for you guys <laughs> because we have not had good luck at all. But I want to be honest because I don't want to like hide it from you guys and be like, oh yeah, it's great. No, this is not great. This is not $200 quality worth at all. I'll keep you guys posted. I don't know. I don't know if I'll make another video on this, but I definitely want to share it with you. I really thought this was going to be amazing. It's definitely not. And I know my lighting is not right in here today. So I look washed out and crazy. I just like spur of the moment, like got this in the mail and I was so excited to like share it with my Disney peeps because a Disney family like knows like the magic that comes with this. Like I will say, where is it? Where is it? Where is he? Let's scooch. He's okay right here. Let me grab this. Okay, so I got him at TJ Maxx and he was 20 bucks. Like no joke, like 20 bucks. Look at the face on him compared to the face on this. Like can you tell? Like that face does not look like this face. No. Like, no, no, no. And, like, look at the reindeer, you guys. Like, no. I don't know. Keep it in the comments down below. I'll probably keep you guys posted, like, on Instagram or something. But comment down below what you guys think. Oh, it says, please remove the film to protect this. Oh, that's pretty. If it was, like, legit Disney quality. It says, the wonderful world of Disney Christmas. And it's got, like, a really nice, like, plaque. It's also a scratch, but I don't really care about like a scratch. It's going to be really hard to kind of see that little plaque and what it says. Yeah, it's going to be like near impossible. There you go. You can kind of see it. Yeah. Pretty sure it's going back, you guys. Because if I can get this at TJ Maxx for 20 bucks, like even on Shop Disney, you can get like really nice quality of stuff. Even, I'll even pay more to have like the faces look right. Like this don't look right. I don't know. This was a weird video. I know. I really had high hopes for it because I thought it was going to be amazing. But at least I can take care of these things so you don't have to. <laughs> Maybe that's going to be the slogan. I'll deal with shipping problems. This wasn't really a shipping problem. It came, it was beautifully packaged. I will, I will definitely say that, but... I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. But if you enjoyed this video, do me a favor and give it a big thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. Hit that subscribe, turn on that notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!